Creeping around at night outside a local animal shelter, this man left behind a shocking sight for employees to find in the morning. Thanks for being with us for the news here at 6. A man just showed up claiming, claiming he's the one who left a box of seven dead puppies on a doorstep in the dark of night. This happened early Sunday morning outside the Michigan Animal Rescue League on Featherstone, not far from the old Silver Dome. And that's where we find Jamie Edmonds standing, standing by. Jamie, you just spoke with the man who says he's the one in the video. Yes, I did, Devin. It was quite a surprise. But first, let me give you background. As a news organization, we were called by the Michigan Animal Rescue League today because a man left a box with seven dead puppies on their side porch here on Saturday night. An employee found it on Sunday morning. Of course, it was a gruesome sight. They didn't know who did it. They called Animal Control. They called the Oakland County Sheriff's Office trying to find who did it. And that's where we come in. We were supposed to help find the man. And that's when this happened. Check out the video about 10 minutes ago a man who says his name is Ronnie Fleming showed up to this shelter saying he is the man who left the puppies here he said it was an accident nothing nefarious happened here's what he had to say but there was no reason to try to conceal or anything there was nothing done wrong or anything it was an accident they fell down the sub pump hole the cap got knocked off and they fell down and drowned. Now he says the story is he had a litter of nine puppies. All of them fell down the sump pump. When he came home after the funeral of his mother, he heard puppies barking. He went downstairs, pulled them all out. Two of them survived, seven of them didn't. He didn't know where else to go, so he brought them here. I've now talked to the shelter folks. They said they've called animal control to see if there's anything more to be done. I don't know if they believe the story or not, but Ronnie was very convincing. He was very emotional, and he said he's going to name the two puppies that survived, I believe, Samson and Miracle. Devin, back to you. Uh, really stunning. Uh, I, I imagine that this is uh, really out of the norm. This is just something that these folks weren't really quite prepared to even see, given all the things that they do see on a daily basis. That's right, Devin. McGee Humes is the executive director here, and I talked to her, and she said, you know what? Sometimes people leave animals here on the yeah. side door, the front door, but they're alive. It was disturbing to find dead puppies, and they really wanted to make sure that there was nothing wrong going on here. Sure thing.